Let's try go back to brown with Overtones Golden Brown Coloring Conditioner. I'm Kat, I'm the Drunk Bridesmaid, and today I am going to try to cover over this terrible dye job that went wrong and also fix these very obvious roots. Hopefully all of this is gonna come together and I'm gonna have a gorgeous new brown shade and you're not gonna see my roots anymore. So we'll see what happens. I actually had a bad experience with Overtone last time because I tried to go ginger and the ginger shade turned my hair into a pumpkin spice disaster. And if you wanna see that flaming hot mess, be sure to watch this video. I am gonna give Overtone another chance because I tried light pink and I've tried light blue and I loved those shades. I thought they were really gorgeous. I think Overtone does some amazing colors and I have high hopes that this is gonna work out for me. Um, it was really hard for me to pick out which shade of brown because Overtone has three different shades on their website, golden brown, chocolate brown, and espresso, and it was really hard for me to try to decide from the swatches and the pictures they list online which one is really gonna go right with my hair, and I landed on this, but now that I've got it in my hand I'm like, oh, did I make a mistake? I'm not sure. I'm also not sure how this is gonna cover over the orange from my last Overtone job uh, because I tried really hard to wash this out many times and it's just not coming out and I'm really frustrated. I just want this to be over. Okay, I'm a little nervous, but I am going to saturate all of my hair with this coloring conditioner and I will be right back. Whoa, <laughs> I'm feeling really good about this. Um, I'm very optimistic with this shade. I really hope that when I wash this out, the orange isn't gonna pop through and that this is actually gonna be similar to my hair color. Yes, I'm feeling like this could be the magic elixir to get rid of my last horrible dye job, but um, I shouldn't get this excited until I finally wash this and I'm gonna style it and I'm gonna come back to you and we're gonna see the final product. Okay, wish me luck. Here's golden brown. I was shocked when I got out of the shower, dried my hair, and realized I had really achieved this sort of golden auburn brown shade that I thought I was going to achieve when I purchased Overtone Ginger. Somehow that turned into a flaming orange hot mess, and this turned into a very natural, beautiful shade that I'm so happy with. It's got a lot of dimension to it. You can see, you know, it's got these like golden tones. Um, to me, it seems like a natural hair color, and yeah, as far as the roots, they're still there. I'm a bit bummed about that. You know, I guess Overtone doesn't have any lightening agents in any of their products, so it's just a colored conditioner, so it's not going to lift your hair color up, it's just going to change your hair color, and it really only works on light hair to begin with. If you have dark brown hair like mine, I've tried four or five different shades of Overtone, and none of them do anything to my brown roots and this was no exception. I don't know, I thought since this was a brown shade that it was going to add some color to my already brown hair, but it didn't really seem to do very much. So this is definitely recommended for people who have bleached hair, and I'm really happy I was able to change my hair color from that orangish color that I had at the beginning of this video. I was a little bit worried how it was gonna work with coloring on top of that, and it really did a good job of covering over the orange color. So if you're looking to fix your bleached hair or you just wanna give your hair a break, this is a lot better than doing a box dye that's going to be you know, lightening your hair but also adding some additional stress onto your hair. This is just a good way to condition your hair and kind of transition back to a more natural hair color. Um, you know, I, I'm, I'm happy with how this turned out. If you try the chocolate brown or the espresso shade, which is a little bit darker than this, I would love to know how that works out for you. So please let me know in the comments. I think I wanna try, you know, maybe the chocolate brown next. So let me know if you guys think I should do that. And if you like watching DIY hair vids, you gotta subscribe to The Drunk Bridesmaid. Cheers.